welcome back guys it's align with purpose it's your girl a nash and i wanted to first off by saying i apologize for one not posting like i said i told you guys i would and for two not uploading the video for the women in shots i actually tried to do it i had finished editing it and just wanted to you know go ahead and upload it but for some reason the internet mother nature everything is not going the way i want so instead i'm going to do a quick video on the basis of health and how important it should be to me not just to myself so first off i want to start by saying if you are choosing to live a more holistic life or more intentional life when it comes to what you put in your body from food to beverages to skincare to any type of creams, ointments, or product. I'm happy to I'm, I'm happy, happy and I'm here to help you guys along that journey. Um, but I first want to say it starts with you and your mindset. There's some things you're going to have to give up, some things you'll have to get rid of. And a lot of the things that we're eating now, if you aren't mindful with what you're putting in your body and how it breaks down, or how your body breaks it down, you will have a more difficult process of transitioning than a lot of people like that. It's really not that hard. I have worked for over a decade in healthcare, and I'm gonna be honest. Whenever I go to the hospital and I see a patient, either they're obese or they're going to dialysis or whatever it is, it's because something in their body no longer works and it's not functioning like it used to. And it's signaling to me that along the way to where they got to, neglect happened and was on a consistent basis that led to where they're at in their life right now. I don't want to be you know, the most health fit guru person. What I'm trying to prevent and I'm trying to hopefully teach others is how to not have to go to the hospital. Because when you go to the hospital, how often times do you guys get upset from the weights to the care overall, or just how you treat them? Me, to avoid all that, I treat myself. And the reason I do that, I educate them. I look at what things I need to be taking, I get my necessary labs done so I can see why I'm deficient at, and I see what I need to be aligned with so I can better intentionally for myself, heal myself, and continue the health lifestyle that I have. So, I'm okay. going to say this. If you aren't going to do anything else today, drink some water. But when you drink water, be mindful of the water you're drinking and where it's coming from. If you're gonna drink tap, be mindful. It has byproducts of medication and bodily fluids and contaminants in it. You should probably look into filtering it. Now you can go and get bottled water, but if you really believe, oh, the bottled water that I don't know where it came from and I'm trusting the government to do what's best for me and my best interest to not contaminate the water, flint saying that not because I'm trying to be funny but if the government can get away with doing that what makes you think they're not doing that to you now okay so one thing you guys can do to help mitigate a lot of your issues or at least start filter your drinking water I have a alkaline water bottle that's been about $25 more um, on Amazon and it was worth it because I get a filter every 60 days and you transfer it out and that's the water I drink and it makes the water alkaline. There's also other uh, alkaline filters you can use. You don't necessarily have to use the one I'm using but if you're going to start this health journey just do your research. So you can listen to me all day. I'm good at being a guide but I know what works for me so I can't necessarily tell you what works for you. What I can do is give you the tools to help you benefit yourself but it does start with you guys and hopefully as you see some of your loved ones or your friends, you see what they're going through, it should make you more mindful to pay attention to how you should treat yourself. So, drinking water, make sure it's filtered, make sure it's not bottled, and make sure you're not using plastic. Glass, metal. Natural ingredients, natural products for every day. That's how you should be doing it. Hopefully this helps. 
I'm sorry about the video, guys. I will try and post this sometime this week when the internet and Mother Nature are not working to keep me from posting it. Other than that, I hope you guys have an amazing week. Talk to you later. Love you guys. Mwah.